Robbie! Yeah, that's me, I'm Rob. Well, actually, my name's Robert, but uh, Rob's more casual, you know, it's only three letters. It's also an act of crime. Um, so I go by that. I kind of half live in Arkansas and half live in Oklahoma right now, which I guess makes me fully inbred. Um, <laughs> Yeah, I'm still waiting to get the paperwork back on it, but I've got the prerequisites nailed, so see what happens. Um, I don't know, I've kind of been having a tough time of it lately, and they say that uh, tough times make hard men, and I think there's some truth to that, you know, because uh, lately I cannot stop masturbating. Like, it's been, it's been getting in the way of other things in my life. <laughs> You know those, those uh, stickers they have of Joe Biden on the gas pumps and he's pointing and he said, I did that. I need to get that tattooed next to my penis since he's making me such a hard man with these tough times, dude. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know if you all ever regret financial decisions you made when you were younger. Um, but one year uh, at a Scholastic Book Fair, I spent $40 on a Guinness Book of World Records. And, uh, I still think about that every time I buy drugs, you know? Cause that's like, I spent that money on a list of other people's accomplishments. And they're not even good accomplishments either. I don't know if you've ever looked at the Guinness book. I think what happened was like, the first edition was probably all impressive feats. And then they were like, we gotta make one of these every year. We gotta stack the deck with a bunch of weirdos, dude. Cause the one I got, like you open it up and you see like world's tallest base jump. And then you turn the page and it's just like world's longest fart. And you're like, what? I'm pretty sure I could do that one, you know? Just give me a bike pump and a day off. I'm pretty sure I got it in the bag. Either that or I'm gonna be wearing a colostomy bag. I'm not sure, not sure what my PSI rating is. Um, I need to get that checked. Um, I don't know. I'm kind of avoiding moving into a place right now. Last time I moved into a place, uh, my neighbor came up to me, my new neighbor, and she said, hey, I got this kid, uh, and he's got ADHD, just so you know, my apartment's really loud. And I'm like, I don't think it's gonna make it any quieter that you told me, but thanks. And, uh, but all I, get, you know, all I ever heard coming from her apartment were like sex noises. So I think that lady was lying to me, dude. I think, I don't think her kid has ADHD. Uh, he sounded focused in there. That's, <laughs> Pretty sure most parents just try Ritalin or something, but she's going natural, I guess. That's cool, yeah. Anyway, that's all I got for you guys tonight. Give it up for your host. Hey, come on, one more time, give it up.